Hi everyone and welcome back to another space weather and earth energy update video. We have a bunch of bioelectric activations coming our way. We've just had two X-class flares in the past two days from the old sunspot group 3664 now renamed to 3697 and we have 3691 in the bullseye zone at this moment in time. So a lot of solar potential and also a lot of solar activity that's already happening and a Venus Kazemi coming up on June 3rd, 4th and 5th. On the left side in the Southern Hemisphere, we see a 2.9 X-class flare explode from sunspot group 3697. And then on the 28th, there's actually a far side eruption of quite significance, but we don't see it here. We see it in the chronograph and then today we have a 1.4 X-class flare also launched from 3697. If we rewind that, you see that the energy was kind of bundling up and getting stored. This is the magnetic flux tubes intermingling, conjoining, and then exploding with that 1.4 X-class flare. And a high M-class flare immediately followed it in the coming hours. This caused a shortwave radio blackout over the Atlantic Ocean, Europe, parts of Africa, and North America, South America, with that moving firmly over North America and South America before that high M-class flare also hit, increasing the ionization again, reducing radio propagation, and then that has finally now faded out. Looking at our X-ray flux, we can see that we are on an overall uptrend at this moment in time, and that is going to increase because we have 3691 rotating through the bullseye zone at this moment in time, and we will have 3697 soon rotating into the strike zone, and it will be on the Earth-facing side of the sun for the next 10 days or so. You'll notice with the C3 chronograph view that the bulk of that chronal mass ejection launched from that 1.4 X-class flare and high M-class flare that followed is directed in one location. It's not a halo CME, but as 3697 starts to become more Earth direct, if it continues to launch chronal mass ejections, they're gonna be increasingly likely to be of the halo characteristic and to be sent directly our way. So we have these chronal mass ejections right now being launched to the side, not impacting the Earth, but we see just how big they are, just how dense they are. And don't forget that 3691 right now is in the strike zone. It could launch an X-class flare and a halo CME, and then 3697 will rotate into that zone soon. And both of them eventually will reach the western limb, which is magnetically coupled to the Earth. And if they flare there, they could trigger proton radiation storms. We have more X-ray flux coming in, more light energy overall, more bioelectric activations, more light codes, more solar neutrinos. In general, we have an energy amplification that we are just at the beginning of with this solar revolution. And in the background, the solar system morphic energy field, we have a very significant Venus Kazemi coming up. This is her superior conjunction, a climax moment for four years going all the way back to June 3rd, 2020. And this is also completing a 10 month cycle with Venus going back to her retrograde through Leo. So this is a very significant Venus Kazemi, especially because she has been the ruler of many, many planetary aspects and significant transits over the past 10 months, like the great Jupiter Uranus conjunction at 21 degrees of Taurus, which is the exact same degree that the sun was at when the G5 great geomagnetic storm rocked our planet, giving us one of the strongest geomagnetic storms in centuries. Also a general announcement for everyone is that my planetary resonances course is nearly completed and I've taken the section on the moon talking about its archetypal energies, its different resonances from its tropical revolution, its synodic revolution, its eclipse cycles, its 18.6 year nodal cycles, and I've uploaded that to the channel available for all Schumann superstars. This is one of my special channel memberships at $5.99 a month. And if you join that tier, you can also watch my Earth's Magnetic Field Master Guide ad-free, and I have a special one plus hour lecture on these Schumann resonances. This moon module is about 90 minutes in length, and so it's for everyone that is a special channel member at the Schumann Superstar tier. I hope to see you there, and if you sign up for that, you also get access to the Soul Tribe private Telegram chat, where there's been a lot of interesting discussion over the past couple weeks. So I hope to see you there as well. 
My name is Stefan, sending you all lots of love and light, and I'll see you all in the next video.